uh, it's called a lullaby. So, and this will be for any of my future cho future children to sleep. Slumber, my tiny little human. Lie motionlessly across inches you won't see, or hands of your kitty-shaped clock, which move with a rhythm resonating with your still healthy heart rate. Believe me, child, enjoy the harmony when you can, at a moment when it isn't impossible yet to imitate with eternity without moaning too much, about fortune's jug, fortune's jug of fruit flies swarming down and what is left on your apples, without fear of snowflakes when you learn about how to fear signs, how every rumble in its arboreal complaint becomes a bright autumnal one among the fallen. I know, my little friend, this space here is ne never spacious enough either, and you like to kick walls. You like to raise a hell of revanchous, revanchous skirmishes. But remember this, it takes more than a few grumpy evenings to dismantle some walls, or laying bricks on one is an easier task. Just ask the man on TV, Donald Trump. <laughs> you must grow in your perceiving eyes, my little one. You will be tall, yet a height is not enough to knock what's up down. You must learn about the shovel and why roots are never made of steel. My child, once, once the one last train of your toys take the last stop to the lovely neighborhood where a bunny lords over foxes, upon battlefield ruins where your miniature troops have fought carrying rainbow flags without blood and you've taken a moment of silence for your martyrs only to raise them back to life when a captain's bugle makes a call there is not a non-trivial cause for you to harbor angst about your pillow tonight Thanks.